Hi, my name is Chris and I'm 30 years old. I was diagnosed with psoriasis at the age of 12 and I thought puberty was going to be the hardest part of my life. But little did I know, within a year, I'd be covered 85% in thick, itchy plaques. Now I have three kids, which means I spend a lot of time on play dates and in parks. I cannot tell you how many times parents wouldn't let their kids around me or my kids because they thought I was contagious. I even had a kid come up to me one time, point and say, ew, and then run away. Now looking back, if I could have done anything differently, I would have taken that opportunity to educate or raise awareness then instead of leaving the park early. So before my 30th birthday, I connected with the National Psoriasis Foundation and learned that psoriasis is an autoimmune disease and there actually are a lot of comorbidities that go along with it. So this empowered me to go and talk to my dermatologist about starting more appropriate treatments for my disease. Within six months, I was almost 100% clear. This gave me the confidence I needed to start my YouTube channel, Psoriatic Standup, where I remind people that just because psoriasis is a serious disease, it doesn't mean we have to take ourselves too seriously. I've also gotten involved with my local support division and even had the opportunity to go to my state capitol and speak with the legislators about access to treatment issues. This has all given me a better outlook on my disease. I've met a lot of amazing people in the psoriatic community, and I no longer see my disease as a curse. But instead, I found my life purpose, and that is to raise awareness so that people with this disease don't have to suffer as long as I did. If I can give any advice to people out there with psoriatic disease, it would be, you're gonna have bad days. You're gonna have days where your skin itches, it's painful, it's embarrassing, you don't feel good about yourself, but don't lose hope. Keep getting out there, keep talking to your doctors, and find a treatment that works for you. Also, find a support group through social media, the National Psoriasis Foundation, so you can connect with people who also have this disease. And lastly, just because your skin is a huge part of your identity, it doesn't define who you are.